pokey people welcome to today's video here at the odd oddish thanks for stopping by it is your host nick and nick and we are here live in the pokey lab doing nothing else you guessed it cracking cards what's up holla at your boy nick and nick and today we are on a pursuit we do have a mission we did come here for a reason today and that reason is can we pull this guy? Huh? Can we do it? Can we do it? Can we do it? Can we pull another one? And if we are lucky, because I need one, I've been on a relentless pursuit to get another one. I only pulled one. Round almost 200 packs and counting. Bam. Charizard V Max, baby. And as you guys may have seen, I did pull this one. Pack fresh. And right out of the pack. It has the scratch in it, as you can see right there. So therefore, takes it out of the running for a PSA 10. Probably a solid 9 for sure, but that is not what I wanted. I wanted a PSA 10, so that's what we're going to go for. That's what I want to achieve. That's what I shall get. I'll just keep opening and opening and opening until I get it. <sighs> Which hopefully is sooner than later. You guys know, this gets expensive. But today, guys... What inspired me for this video is I went across the street where I live to Family Dollar to get something to drink. And as I was grabbing my Gatorade, I just happened to walk by the Pokemon section. And what did I see? <laughs> what did I see? Bam, baby. Found some Evolution sleeved blisters for their regular price of $3.99. And uh, sure, as you guys know, these are getting a little harder to find in the wild especially by itself you can always get them in other uh like other box sets and stuff like that but if all you want is the evolutions pack you know who the heck wants to buy a box set for just the evolutions pack so when i see them in groups like this i pick them up i scoop them i cop them you know what i do for you guys so we can all open them together and hopefully pull one of these guys live here in the pokey lab on the odd oddish and we'll do it together and then next up after that after the after the entree then for dessert i got us a little sleeved darkness ablaze bonus blister with sword and shield base pack and for our second round of dessert another sword and shield darkness ablaze bonus blister pack with sword and shield base pack bonus dun, 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 dun. and that is gonna be our opening today guys so with further ado you know what i say you know how it goes let's get cracking let's get cracking let's see where do you guys want to go for luck by your daddy charizard xy flash flash fire pack okay sounds good all right and these sleeves these are like theft free sleeves <coughs> normally i know you just rip them open but i keep uh, i delicately open them because uh I have some cool displays and uh, peg hooks, and I dress the pack up like that, and you can't even tell that it's been opened, and I hang it up until I can replace it with more sleeves, or maybe put some of my uh, Evolutions booster boxes, but then that would require me to open it, which I also don't want to do, because I'm just saving those bad boys, even though I want to open them so bad. I can't take it. It takes so much self-discipline in which I do not have. There we go. Code card, folks. And try to not take all the code cards so some other people can get them. Actually, you know what? If you're here watching my video, do what you got to do. I understand. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a TCG online player, too. So I feel you. I feel you with the packs. Oh, secret rare. There we go. Flying Pikachu. 110 out of 108. Uh, cool card, but unfortunately, as of right now, during this recording, they are not worth much. They should have at least made it like a hollow or something. Wouldn't that be so sick if they would just hollow foiled that? Dude, lost opportunity there. That card would have been so sick and differentiate it from the, from the older one that this is repl replicating. But I'm just a consumer, not a, not a designer. Oh, man. I got a question for this guy. Don't we, guys? Don't we? Where's your daddy? Rattata. Caterpie. Magnemite. 
something falling in the background. Hope it's all okay. Probably Pokemon cards. Growlithe Reverse Hollow Common. Hey, look at that pattern, though. Oh, 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 got some imperfections right there. Not that I'm going to do anything with this, but you never know. Back in the day, or in the future, five, ten years or something, maybe people will look at evolutions like they look at the legendary set now, you know, and even the common reverse hollows are something special. And guys, in the rare slot, first pack, family dollar, four dollar evolutions blister sleeve, Venusaur EX, baby. Woo! What's up, bro? Yes, dude. Killing it. I love my boy Venusaur. You're my dog, Green. You're my boy, Green. You're my boy. You're my boy, Blue. All right, we'll sleeve up this Growlithe so nothing happens to it. Damage, potentially damage the, the hollow pattern. I don't want anything else to happen to it except what's already on it, which isn't that bad. But here we go. Venusaur EX. Let's check her out. Here's what we do. All right. Wow. 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 Man. Wow, dude. Oh my. Oh my gosh. Like, wow, dude. This car looks like super good. Uh, super duper Sicaroni. Nice, dude. Super stoked. No, but for real, this card looks beautiful. I just want you to know you may be a PSA 10 contender. Do do. Do -do. Venusaur, I just want you to know you may be a PSA 10 contender. All right, guys, up next we got the Raichu pack. <coughs> so we are off to a fantastic start. We got one, uh, one ultra rare Venusaur EX, beautiful condition. Maybe someday a PSA send that bad boy in. I already just have so many other cards to, to send in, so that may be put on the back burner, but I will put it in the box. You guys know what box I'm talking about. Y'all know, and if you don't, I'll show you. Just give me a second. Code card. And we have one, two, three, to the front. Flip it around. Kakuna. Energy Retrieval. Original Artwork. Blastoise Spirit Link. Magikarp. Let's see. Let's let's do a quick comparison, just because I have this laying around for some reason. Here's a original base set. Okay, so there's definitely more blue on the Evolutions version. See how it's longer down here? There's actually more blue on it, and the borders on the original are a lot wider. I don't want to flip it around to reveal anything from the pack, but. Just in case you guys are ever wondering, artwork. I was just kind of wondering. Just curious, just because I had it laying around. They changed the basic. Just written here, and here it has a little fancy schmancy diamond. Length, weight. Height, weight. Both fish Pokemon. And they abbreviated the height and width. Okay, let's move on. Now, sorry for the 13 minute uh, Magic Carp comparison segment. Start a new uh, odd oddish short series, limited series. Growlithe, Nidoran is that male? Nidoran male. Ooh, speaking of, all right. Sorry guys, got to get it out again. Let's do a comparison. No, I'm just kidding. But look at that though, yo! Look at that though. Look at it though, dude. Over here, look. Look at it though. Nice. Oh, 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 wow, 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 what? All right. Well, I mean, it's still good. No scratches. That's definitely a factory defect or whatever, but I know there's a lot of Magikarp fans out there. Shout out to uh, our, our boy, uh, Pokebrev. My man. My idol, Pokebrev. Love you, man. And in the rare slot, guys. Ready? Boom. Star me, baby! Oh my gosh, I so didn't need that. Get out of here! Thank you, Star me, I can't stand those. I'm sorry, folks, but I just, all the rares in this evolution set, I've pulled so many. I just can't stand them. I can't stand them. Or I mean, what it is that the the, the Star me was just so good, right? I just I my hands could not bear 
to hold such greatness. So they just kind of like freaked out like a reflex and it just it just squoze. My hands just squoze. I couldn't handle such greatness. I can do the Venusaur, the Charizards, but no, 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 no. No, no evolution Starmie rare. I, yeah. It's, I'm, 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 not, I'm not on that level yet, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Venusaur pack. Here we go. Y'all ready to rip? Right, guys, let's rip it, flip it, dip it, and stick it, and pull it, and get it out. Dude. Dude. Unreal, dude. All right, guys. We got her open. We did it together. I appreciate you guys cheering me on for that. We got one, two, three to the front. Flip it around. Ooh, Magmar. Original OG, baby. Venusaur Spirit Link. Metapod. Sand Shrew. Polywag. Gosh, is this set just so nostalgic. I love it. I love it. I almost do have this whole master set too. Maybe I'll have to show you guys my Evolutions master set sometimes. I'd like to show show you guys some of my collections here. Top three sets I almost... No, top four. Uh, actually, top five sets I almost have completed. Shining Legends. Well, I mean, Hidden Fates. I'm like halfway there. The Shiny Vault. I have maybe 50... And then Evolutions, I'm almost there. Full set, hollows, reverse hollows, all that. And then uh, Darkness Ablaze and Sword and Shield base. Like all those, I am like almost there. 20 or less cards. All right, guys, we got the Caterpie reverse hollow. Another manufacturer defect right there. And for the rare slot, M. Pidgeot, EX, Pidgeot, 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 Pidgeot. I got an M Pidgeot EX. Winning though, Pinky O. Okay, Pinky O. Okay, yep. There we go, guys. We got two EX hits. Pidgeot and Venusaur. No textured cards and a secret rare. The Pikachu, which is a cool card, but could have been way better. If, if, if Pokemon were ever to listen, don't be putting old secret, rare, non hollow cards in sets ever again. It's kind of whack. Let me know in the comments if you guys agree with that, or unless that's just me, but... It can't be just me. It can't be. Code card, folks. And we got one, two, three to the front. Flip it around town. There we go. Another secret rare. Here comes Team Rocket supporter. Non hollow, and the original card was hollow, so they actually went back and turned it into a non hollow 113 out of 108. Um, you know, another it's a secret rare, supposed to be a very exciting pull, but unfortunately, it is not all that exciting because it's not worth nothing, it's not shiny, doesn't grab your attention, doesn't interest anyone. So let's proceed, Magmar. Yo! On uh, what, bro? No way. <clears throat> Do you guys see that? Out of the same pack, and I've never had this happen before, I pulled Here Comes Team Rocket and Surfing Pikachu. Wow, dude, that's crazy. Two secret rares, double banger with extra cheese and sauce on the side. Yo, that's crazy. That okay, guys. Another com another question for the comments. Has anybody else ever pulled two secret rares out of one pack? Because I have not. Never, ever, ever. Imagine if it was a pack that had like actually cooler secret rares that were like, you know, make you like happy when you pull them. Man, that's crazy. It's neat. It's pretty neat, and it's on camera, so that's pretty cool. All right, guys. Again, let's proceed. Let's proceed with what you need. Ooh, not a star me, but a star you. Oh, metal energy. And are we at the reverse hollow? Nope. Growlithe and Ghastly and Charmander. Uh, where's your daddy? Magnemite reverse hollow. Or yep, reverse hollow common. Hollow pattern looks good. And in the rare slot, Mewtwo. <laughs> Non hollow rare. Another card oh, that my hands just want to squeeze. 
But at least it's Mewtwo and I collect Mewtwo. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we had ten cards in this pack, and it's supposed to have Yep, ten additional game cards, including the energy, because not every single pack comes with an energy. But that was pretty crazy. That was pretty crazy. Plus the code card. Can't believe I got two secret rares in one pack. Like I said, oh, I don't need to sleeve that up. Imagine if it was a card that is a little more exciting to pull. That'd be nuts, bro. That'd be sick. Sleeve up this surfing Pikachu. And you can go hang out with your other buddy there. All right, guys. Next up, this is our fifth pack. I, gotta, I must say, we got we got some we got a lot of shiny on there, and the secret rares, if that means anything. Maybe someday they'll be a little more desirable. That'd be neat. I mean, the Serving Pikachu is cool. I bet if you get it graded, it's a little something something, you know. People would want that. I want that in my collection. That's, but I have the Surfing Pikachu, the one that came in the World P Pikachu, whatever. They had like nine of them. I have that one um, in a PSA 10. One, two, three. To the front. Flip her around. We're going to start her off with a switch. Kakuna Magnemite. Machoke. Full heal. Magnemite. Water energy. Growlithe. Machop with the weight of the world on his on his shoulders. Voltorb. Little nightlife Voltorb right there. Ooh. Ooh. Woo. And a Beedrill, another card I'd I'd really dis or I mean love. I really hate love. <laughs> there we go, guys. Okay, we got a break card. I can dig it. That's party. Uh, the centering on it from what you can see looks pretty good. And on the back, yeah. I mean, this is a perfect card actually. If break cards are ever a little more desirable. You know what? Just because this one is in perfect condition, I'm going to sleeve this up, and that's going into the PSA potential pile. I know it's not much now, but I just put them in there, which signifies that I looked at it, inspected it, and believe it's a very... Uh, it's a good contender for a 10. And if I never needed just some filler cards to make, you know, for the bulk bulk special or whatever, I could always throw that in. All right, guys, we got another Rachu pack. Rachrizzle, my drizzle. Ooh, look who we got. I know who that is. I know who you are. We've met before. We have met before. And we have one, two, three to the front. Flip it around. We're going to start off with a Haunter. Brock's Grit. Slow Bro Spirit Link. Charmander. Where's your daddy? Diglett. Ghastly. Caterpie. Drowsy. Ooh, Electrobuzz Reverse Hollow. That's cool. Electabuzz, dude. That's sick, dude. I like that. This is a card everybody remembers. Was this... Wasn't this... Was this a rare in base set? Or an uncommon? I don't think it was a common, but... Love this card. I think everybody knows this card that's around my age and got back into collecting. Look at that hollow pattern, man. It's beautiful. This one I'll actually probably sleeve up and hard hard sleeve too. Top load. Alright, guys. Rare slot. Gyarados, baby. Gyarados, baby! Yes, dude! This, this pack's like a double banger right here. <coughs> Alright, guys. This is... Dude, this is nice! Let's check we checked out the electable let's check out the gyarados um centering left to right is a little off top to bottom and on the back dude, the back don't look horrible though it doesn't look horrible yo that's sick dude look at that i love that see all those sparkly star things in the background i love it i have it but i love it it's a hollow hit, folks. In all my evolutions, because I've opened booster boxes, just because I've enjoyed opening this set so much, um, that I have, uh, I don't know, doubles of like everything. I'm just trying to get some like reverse hollows. There's really none of the harder cards in the set that I need to get. Like I said, it's really just reverse hollows and stuff like that. Man, that's beautiful. 
But um, all my Evolutions cards like this, just the Hollows, right now or a little bit, you know, before right now, they weren't worth all that much. But I think that they these as well. I just think the whole Evolution set in general will will raise in price. So for a while, I wasn't even putting these in top loaders, but now I went back through and put all these, um, you know, just the old reprint Hollows and Evolutions from the older sets. I've been putting them into. Uh, into top loaders to preserve for preservation i don't even know what to do with this bro let's put these guys here because i didn't pull them this time around i did pull these just not not now we need to create space for the hit squad what a hit squad looking good looking good all right guys and now we have our Darkness of Blaze bonus blisters with sword and shield base pack bonus. Woo! That's tongue twister. Say that one times fast. You know what I mean, bro? You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? All right. Let's start her off with the sword and shield base. Test your luck. Test your luck. Y'all know where that's from. Mortal Kombat! Do 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 Bless you. Thank you. Nice, dude. I just pulled one of these the other days out of this pack. <gasps> Y'all saw that? Uh-oh. Okay, so I'm happy with this Pikachu. I put these aside, and it's Pikachu, and these I will send in, send in to get graded. This one, though, is uh, off left to right, and I just saw texture, and let's get it! Wait, dude, I thought I saw texture, bro. Ah, uh, come on! That's all right. It's still uh, technically an ultra rare hit, so that's cool. The winner out of that pack, definitely the Pikachu. Definitely. Gotta love it. I do love it. We got a whole gang of Pikachus here. Pika P. All right, guys, we got the Darkness Ablaze. Charizard V Max. Come on out. It's time to play. You can come out of hiding. Let's just get it, get it cracking. Just come on out. Just tappy, tappy, tappy. Don't you want to go to your home? Just tappy, tappy, tappy. Just a little pull, pull, pull. Just open the pack and pull it. Just you got to pull the card. Just to, just break it open and, and, and open it, bro. Tappy, tappy, tappy. Rokity. Fly away! <laughs> you know, the shout out to Real Breaking Nate. We got a metric, reverse hollow rare, and a Arctivish non hollow rare. Boo! 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 That's all right, folks. We got two left still. And here at the Hot Oddish, we remain positive that we will get the best pulls. Why? Because attitude is everything. The universe will award you. Good karma, if you just do the right thing, help others, be kind, be honest, and good things will come your way. I firmly believe. Every time I pull a really good card, like a Charizard or something, I'm like, I must have done something right. Because <laughs> I pulled a banger. Team Yell Grunt. Drizzle. Drizzle. Glaring Stunfisk. Oops, skipped one. Jinjow. Krabby. Minchin, Galarian Ponyta, love that card. Cottony, Rosalia, Reverse Hollow Common, and a Clay Doll. Whack card. Alright, guys. Last pack, Magic Baby. One more chance at a Charizard V Max. That would just. Oh. I can feel it now. The feeling. I can hear it now. The yelling. <laughs> the excitement. You have one, two, three, four to the front. Flip! 
flip it around. We're going to start off with a Psychic Energy. Vanillish. Poltergeist. Soul Rock. Glaring Mr. Mime. Grimer. Clink. Skitty the Kitty. Pansage. Fletchling. Hydrogagron. Hydrogagron. Reverse. Non Hollow Rare. Dang it! Oh, that's a very good card, but darn it, I didn't want it now. Oh, man. Well, I can't have us leave on a note like that, guys, so here we go. Overtime! Come on, baby. We just need one more hollow hit, and we win. We win together. One more hollow hit, and we got code card. We got one, two, three, four to the front. Flip it around. Psychic energy. Switch trainer. Ferrothorn, Raboot, Sizzlepeed, Yamper, Clavopis, Cottony, Choodle, Rillaboom Reverse, Hollow Rare, and a Lantern, non hollow hit. So that means we must keep pulling. That means we must keep pulling. Next up, Zumazenta Pack, and you better have a hollow in the pack, or else I will keep ripping. One, two, three, four, to the front. Let's get flipping. Fire energy, Galarian Linoan. Seeking, Ordinary Rod, Shelter. Crow Gunk, Silicobra, Minichino. yo Minich, Minichino, whatever. Vulpix, and a Salandit Reverse Hollow. Sanaconda Hollow Hit. There you have it, folks. We did it. We did it together. Thank you for your help. I appreciate you guys sending positive vibes through this Wi-Fi signal or whatever technical term you would use to send vibes through uh, means of electricity. And uh, <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> there we go. So land it. We got the Santa Con and end it on a hollow hit because we don't stop. We don't We don't end the video on non-hollow hits here at in the Pokey Lab, man. That would be lame. Who wants to see that? I will never waste your guys' time like that with some whack junk like that. I promise. You got my word. And, folks, thank you so much for stopping by and hanging out here in the Pokey Lab with the Odd Oddish channel. I appreciate you taking your time, taking time out of your day to spend it with me to crack some cards together. I appreciate you wanting to hang out with me to entertain you and to pull some dope cards for me. I appreciate that very much. So I hope y'all have a fantastic day. And when you guys buy some cards, when you're hunting, I hope you find some hidden fates or whatever set it is you're looking for. And when you crack them bad boys open, I hope you get some sick pulls. And if you do, let me know in the comments, bro. Let me know about it. I always love hearing pack, you know, hits out of packs. I like to find pack ratios, hit ratios. I love hearing all that, man. I'm always studying, trying to figure out how to be a better Pokemon puller. The best Pokemon trainer I can be. And again, thank you guys. I appreciate you guys so much. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. And you'll get notified for more videos like this with more cards all the time. Always cracking. I got Hidden Fates, Shining Legends, Burning Shadows. Dude, I got, man, so many good cards that are just waiting to be broke open too. So, again, thank you guys so much. Have a great day. This is Nick at Nick signing out. Peace.